We've gotten some added confirmation on the Z390 motherboard that's rumored to house Intel's upcoming 8-core CPU. Unfortunately, that new Z370 you just bought? Yeah, you might have to upgrade again. Stay tuned. Welcome back to Gamer Melt. It was a problem so many people had with Intel's 8th generation CPUs. The Z270 motherboard, which had just come out the year prior, didn't support Intel's newest 6 core CPUs. The claim was understandable, but still frustrating. It didn't have the pins to deliver enough power for the two added cores. Sure, some have been able to get it to work, but it has limitations. Simply put, Intel didn't see AMD coming in with so much to offer, and, just like their Core X enthusiast series, had to scramble to get something competitive back on the market. So, instead of giving us the best they had, Intel seems to have been feeding us just enough to call it an upgrade without having to do much. That's the unfortunate side effect of a company not having any real competition for so long. It's mostly not against Intel though, since they had the best products on the market and stagnation always occurs. Well, apparently Intel may have been even more surprised than we initially thought, and simply threw together the Z370 to get something to support a 6-core CPU out. That, of course, explains exactly why the B360 and H310 weren't even announced until just recently. Well, given I'm correct, their poor planning is going to cost you dearly. Originally reported by video cards, Intel released official information on their chipsets within release notes regarding their storage tech. In it, the Z390 was officially confirmed, which was the initial report. But as I always check on sources before discussing something, I noticed another story much bigger. While it had been assumed from time to time since the original Z390 information was leaked that the Z370 motherboard won't go on to support their next generation Canon Lake CPUs, well, it, it's true. In fact, they even have it listed as a 200 series chipset, and you can see it only supports Coffee Lake, while the newest 300 series motherboards that were just announced support both Coffee Lake and Canon Lake, Intel's next generation CPU architecture. Now, some people claim that Canon Lake is nothing but mobile chips, but you can see that it's supported on the HEDT X399. Remember that HEDT stands for high-end desktop, so I doubt that's the case. And remember that when Intel discussed Ice Lake, they stated it would be a successor to 8th gen. Now it says it will be the next generation core. Could Canon Lake still be considered 8th gen? I'm really not sure, but even if Ice Lake is the ultimate successor, it seems quite clear that the Z370 won't support it especially since Intel considers it a 200 series motherboard. Basically, I don't see why this would be wrong, so as long as I'm not missing something, the Z370 won't support Coffee Lake in any way, including any lower core chips, not just the rumored 8 core CPU, unless of course that's all they release, but I doubt it. No, that's the purpose of their Z390. Clearly, the 370 just wasn't designed to deal with their next generation CPUs because as I'd assume, Intel rushed it out along with their 6-core Coffee Lake to further deal with AMD's Ryzen processors. So while that does it for today, let me know what you think. Did I miss something or is Intel about to do it again? Let me know down in the comments below. And if you like the video and want to keep up with all things gaming hardware news and reviews, don't forget to subscribe. And as always, have a great day.